Billionaire businessman Ned Nwoko has said it is impossible to stop the four-year term of the president-elect Ashiwaju Bola Tinubu after the May 29 inauguration. Nwoko explains that once the president-elect was sworn in, the petition filed against him at the presidential elections petition tribunal in Abuja might not see the light of the day. Obi had filed a petition to challenge Tinubu's victory in the February 25 presidential election. Obi, who came third in the election in his petition, alleged that the election was characterized by irregularities, praying that Tinubu's victory be annulled. Mwoko, however, stated that the Labour Party's poor assessment of the situation and unrealistic expectations led to his defeat. Mwoko, who spoke with journalists in Abuja on Thursday, said, had the opposition parties teamed up, they would have defeated the ruling All Progressives Congress in the election, given the poor performance of the current APC regime, led by the President, Major General Momodu Buhari, retired. Nwoko reiterated that an alliance government would have been the perfect opportunity for Obi to save Nigeria's economy as he avowed in his campaigns. He stated that it was now near impossible to stop Tinubu from becoming president, despite the petitions signed against him once inaugurated. The senator-elect maintained that the ruling All Progressive Congress (APC) would have suffered a severe defeat in the presidential election if the oppositions had aligned. He further pinned the blame on the Labour Party and obedience, stressing that they were too self-absorbed to give room for logical reasoning.